Hello everyone. March 18, 2020 marked the beginning of an unprecedented and uniquely challenging time when COVID-19 invaded our lives. No one could predict the impact this virus would have on each of us, considering the many changes we've now grown accustomed to during the past six months. However, the most devastating outcome has been the loss of our beloved Mary Haven family members. To those of you who shared personal relationships with those we've lost, I offer my deepest condolences. Many of you had great fondness for our individuals who bravely battled coronavirus. I too have known several personally for many years and have wonderful memories. Each one is sorely missed. To the families, it has been our privilege to serve your loved one. They brought so much joy and meaning to our lives. To the employees we've lost, you are true heroes to us. You dedicated your professional life to helping the vulnerable with enthusiasm and passion. Your sacrifice will always be remembered. To all of our committed workforce, once again, you've proven there is nothing we cannot achieve when working as a team. You have stayed the course and battled through the most difficult time in our agency's history. I know this does little to ease the pain of our losses. I am proud that we honor their lives with personal accountability and selfless acts of kindness. Thank you. Good and gracious God, we come today to remember, to celebrate, and to believe in the lives of those who have been called home to you during this coronavirus epidemic. Our lives and our hearts have been deeply saddened by their death, especially since very often we were not able to be with them. Come. Be near to us, dear God. Strengthen and give us support for the days ahead. Help us, too, to continue this work of care and companionship to those in need. Be near to us this day, God. Amen. I light this candle for Karen Carmelo. I light this candle to remember Sal Cavaluzzi. I light this candle to remember Kevin Durbin. I light this candle to remember Michelle Dolan. I light this candle to remember Michael Hill. I light this candle to remember Robert Lefkowitz. I light this candle to remember Sue Mueller. I light this candle to remember Howard Navarro. I light this candle to remember Gerard Pertardi. I light this candle to remember all of our family and friends who have died during these months. The light of these candles represents our grief. The pain of losing you is intense. It reminds us of the depth of our love for you. The light of your remembrance continues. The light of these candles represents our courage to confront our sorrow, to comfort each other, to change our lives. The light of your memories continues. These candles represent our memories of you. To the times we laughed, the times we cried, 
the times we were angry with each other, the silly things you did, the caring and joy you gave us. The light of your remembrance continues. This is the light of our love. As we experience and reflect upon the occasion of this memorial service, we cherish the special place in our hearts that have always be reserved for you. We thank you for the gift your life brought to each of us. We love you always. The light of your remembrance continues. Do not let your hearts be troubled. You have faith in God. Have faith also in me. In God's house there are many dwelling places. If there were not, would I have told you that I'm going to prepare a place for you? I will come back again and take you to myself, so that where I am, you may also be. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. Do not let your hearts be troubled or afraid. I am with you, I will not leave you. You are the face of God I hold you in my heart You are a part of me You are the face of God You are the face of God I hold you in my heart you are a part of me You are the face of God You are the face of God Tu es l'image de Dieu I hold you in my heart Tu es l'image de l'amour You are a part of me You are the face of God you are the face of God to say la luce di Dio. I hold you in my heart to say il volto dell'amore. You are a part of me. You are the face of God. You are the face you of love. For the remembrance prayer, please join me in the, rem the response, we remember them. At the rising of the sun and at its going down, we remember them. At the blowing of the wind and in the chill of winter, we remember At the opening of the buds and in the rebirth of spring, we remember them at the blueness of the skies, and in the warmth of summer. We remember them. At the rustling of the leaves, and in the beauty of autumn. We remember them. 
at the beginning of the year and when it ends. We remember that. As long as we live, they too will live, for they are now part of us. We remember that. When we are weary and in need of strength. We remember that. When we are lost and sick at heart. We remember that. When we have joy we crave to share. We remember that. When we have decisions that are difficult to make. We remember that. When we have achievements that are based on theirs. We remember that. As long as we live, they too will live for they are now part of us. As we remember that. You, God, are the author and sustainer of our lives. You are our final home. Turn to us who have suffered these great losses. Strengthen us in your mercy and love. Strengthen, too, the bonds of this family, this workplace, this community. Confirm in us faith, hope, and love so that we may bear your peace to one another. We ask this in the name of your Son, Jesus. Amen.